once we get to lock up, things change a little bit. We're managing a lot more different subcontractors that are working on a lot shorter time frame. No longer do you have one bricklayer on site, one roof carpenter on site. You've got a painter working in with a tiler, working with an electrician. A lot of organized chaos, a lot of planning goes into it, but when it does come off, it's even more rewarding because you can see it all come together. at the Lakelands Display Home today to go through the tile selections that we made a bit earlier on in the build. And we're just going room by room and checking that all the tiles that were delivered are the correct ones, but as well we're talking a bit about placements, grouts, and how the flow of the home will go with these tile layouts. All this has already been thought about, like all this has been considered before we get to this point. So really what we're doing is we're coming in and kind of double checking over the decisions we made, which are basically just on paper, um, and how they look in the three the three dimensional, and and obviously like how good this looks is based on the experience of the team. The tile meeting isn't as straightforward as you think. We want to make sure the layout is correct, the cut pieces are where they should be, and that the patterns are running as they need to be. Chop off the bottom at the very first row. Cut off two centimeters off the first time. Even if I go half, if you do half, then you'll be left yeah. with three quarters at the top. Correct. Okay. Yeah. Yep. yeah. So show and return up to the other side of this one here. So then you're going to have an angle here and an angle there. So did you want to mirror it? Just do all here. Showing all the other walls and then here is where the feature is going. And the plans are showing arched. Round. Do you want arched or round? It's an important stage of the build for us to have this meeting. Once tiles are laid, it's really hard for us to go back and make different choices. So we like to host this meeting to ensure that we get it correct the first time around. I think you need to attend these meetings. I, I recommend this to my clients as well. These are key stages of your build. With the troubleshooting of an issue, I normally hear from construction or Reese about uh, a particular problem and then we just kind of get together and find a solution. And normally there's a lot of solutions to any problem. There wasn't any problems uh, as such, but there were kind of some tricky design elements that um, we wanted to get exactly right. There's a lot of discussions about the timber feature panelling to the front elevation. Something we really wanted to make sure we got right. Jason was really excited. That was his hero piece of the front elevation. Having not used the product before, I wanted to make sure that we had done what we needed to do before they attended. And then just trying to deal with some of the product availabilities to make sure that that was in before we were finished and that it was done properly. Um, it was definitely a little bit of a challenge, but I think the way it's finished up has definitely really, really made the house and it's an attractive element as soon as you pull in off the straight. Once we reach practical completion, I'm practically finished and I get to hand over to the interiors team. They get to do the furniture styling, the staging, all the interior design aspects that really finish the display off nicely. Obviously for them to do that, I need to make sure the house is complete and the house is clean. Yeah, I'm, I'm really excited to see how, how it's all finished up. Yeah, we've been we've been watching it, the process, and it's, and it's getting very exciting when you're kind of seeing the finishing touches all come together now. Looking forward to seeing the furniture come in and all the landscaping done. Uh, I think it's gonna be a real strong mid-century home for that area. I like this house. I actually really like it. Jason and Adriana have done a good job picking everything. Uh, it's starting to come together and look really nice. So I'm excited to see how it finishes up.